And today, I'm gonna show you my Lego crane! Oh! The way it works, it's got a little winch here. Oh, that lifts on that, and then you just wind that, and it um gets stuck in the gears when it winds backwards, and then you go like that, it goes free again. And then, to make it so if you want it just dangling, if you want it to release quickly, you can... So there's this thing here. And stop playing with the guitar. Fine. And then, so you pull that up. Go. You put that there so it holds the winch in place. So you can just free, like, do it freely without the winch mechanism. And then if you take this away, like this, engages the winch, and then reels up. So for the counterweight, I'm just using this thing here. It's so cool. Yeah, it's a charger. And then for the thing yeah. you're using is a thing. A thing, a thing, a thing. You call it a thing, but yeah, it's yeah, not yeah. A thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, so anyway, that's it for the crane. And now, so I'm, gonna need, show it to me. now I'm gonna show you my yabbies. So, in this one, I've got, I haven't named him yet. Uh, the wood is a bit dirty because it's been pooing a lot. So, you just pick him up. Come back. Come back, my darling. See? Um, he looks cute. Yeah. It's a he because. Hold on, like this. He might nip you. If he does, it's don't, a, don't scream out. It's a he because it's got no. A she, a female usually has two circles there, but males don't have two circles. No. So, yeah, it's not. And this one's Bob. He's just recently shed his shell. It's a. He's bigger than before. Oh my goodness, he's big. Yeah. How long has he been in there for? Oh, he's been in there. Ow, oh, nipping me with his feet. God. Yeah, this fella's quick. Yeah. And he's a male too. Make sure he doesn't, um, make sure he, the next time he, um, make sure the next time he, um, he escapes. Try not to. No, he didn't try escape. Not to him here, if you come out here, I'll show you Jeff. My name's Jeff. Didn't he die? She. Jeff is a she guy. Oh yeah, that's right. Pick. This is Jeff. She was a she was a kind fella. Not really. A kind fella. And she's a, a kind, she. A kind lady, I mean. A lady? It's a yabby mate. It's kind of yabby. Whatever. And this is her other nipper. Oh, that's so cute. That's her big. Can I have some crummies? No thanks. Okay, back in the room. He's quick. Um, in this one, shut up. <laughs> shut up. Um, in shush, shush. In this tank, um, we've got lots of little yabbies. Uh, so we've got here's one. Here's one. Oh god, they're too, they're too fast. Too quick, yeah, I know. Um, oh, there's a tiny little one in here too. They're not so tiny. They're all too far. Oh, damn it. He's got my nippers. Oh, no. He's got no nippers. Oh, no. Where did his nippers go? They must have fallen off. It's a looking claw. One claw. Nah. Is he growing? No, he's not really growing. It's <laughs> a new one. This fella's growing, though. Yes. This was one Whoa, of the... Oh, he is quick uh, as. This was one of the... Holy hell. This... Um, this was one of the little yeah, yabbies I had. Can't even keep up. Yeah. So anyway, yeah, I got some more in here. Um, just to take this off. I think I've got little baby barramundi in here. Yep. That's the camera now. Um, See that one there? I think it's about like a little. <laughs> and there comes the big one. Yeah. There's the guppy. I got them. I had a. I got a few of them from the Prossy Dam. So. 
I don't, I don't, they could be sooty grammar or something like that. But here, back on the camera, man. So now, I'm going to try and grab these yabbies out of here. This is another clawless one. Oh, jeez. It's so fast. Oh, there's a big shrimp. Oh, I didn't think it. There you go. Done. I can't get them ones out, they're too fast. Bam bam. And in here I've got a crab. Four minutes. Well, that's all from the recording. Um, in here I've got the crab. As you, he's massive now because he's just shedy shell and in here there's another yabby there. Where is he? The little where, where, where's that giant? Oh, the crab, he's right there. What, I can't see. I see him. No, I don't. Um, the crab's in there somewhere. Anyway. So, that's it there. Whoops, sorry about the guitar, mate. Yeah. I'm sorry, but that's out of tune. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, so, now I'm going to show you the shells that have recently been <laughs> so These are all the shells. Oh, my goodness. Th a... This is the crab shell. Ooh, gosh, that's a piece. It's tiny. <laughs> that's Bob's shell. And another half and there's all bits of other shells in there they're really brittle so they keep breaking um i also made a little lure you can't see it oh my goodness that's great. it's like a, it's kind of like a pop-up um thing and then this is a crane. no that's, that's a little it's not sweet. off like a pen yeah it's half of a pen but i made it into a lure i've just got to attach i'm hungry attach these trebles on here. In a moment, I'll just show you the picture of an Australian bass I drew. But we'll do that after I show you the rest of my homemade lures. So, this one's a spinnerbait jig. Mm. You see that good? Yep. It's got a little curl tag grub on there. Um, this is another, um, hang on. That's another spinnerbait. Just hasn't got the spinner on it. Nice. Uh, this is a spoon lure. Hang on, broken. Spoon lure? Okay. Spoon lure. Did you put that with did you put foil on that? Yeah, to make it reflect light. So yeah, that's all the lures I've made. And now I'm gonna show you the picture of the Australian bass. <laughs> 